Hey guys, Andre Kweli, The Labors for Hercules, episode 11. Uh, kind of a different day today. It's 7.10 p.m. and I usually work out at noonish, but I am working out with two beginner lifters, so I'm going to be recording the workout and showing them some tips on the chest exercises that it consists of. So I'll see you guys in the gym. Tell me! Hey guys, Andre Kweli with another commentary. Uh, as I said in the beginning, I worked out with two beginner lifters. Their name was Dan and Matt, and I actually graduated with them last May. And they want to start getting into the gym and uh, learning how to lift weights with proper form. So I gave them some tips, such as retracting the scapula and how to activate the chest properly on all these lifts. And it's funny because I, th on this set, this is my second set, and I actually failed. I was supposed to get eight, and it was a pyramid set, and I only got seven because I thought it was 165 on the bar, and they actually loaded 170 on the bar, and I thought it was 165, so I was kind of freaking out because I thought I lost some strength. But, that, yeah, that kind of threw me off a little bit, so here you see me doing 175 for what's supposed to be six, and I only got five. So that 170 for what was supposed to be a kind of threw me off. So next week I'm going to make sure that the right weight is loaded onto the bar so I can hit my goals uh, correctly. And as you can see, when I failed, I just reset and hit a single for the 170 and the 175 just to get my reps in. Right here we moved on to the flat dumbbell press and Matt was kind of struggling with the dumbbells but after I showed him the correct path for the dumbbell and how to retract the scapula of course and where to lower the weight and how to raise the weight uh, he got the form down so he's gonna uh, be consistently just trying to work on form and then he'll progressively go up in weight. Here you're seeing my third set of 70 and I only got 8 but I got my first two sets with 10. So next week I'm going to go for the 70s for 3 or 4 sets of 10. The Y did not have a hammer strength machine for the alternating presses so we just improvised and did the incline machine press. And I was kind of, since it was kind of different I just played with the grip a little bit so right here you see me with the uh, closer grip in and in the next set you'll see me doing the other grip it's been interesting these last couple weeks working out with Adam who is strong uh, with his pressing his upper body and working out with these uh, with Daniel who is a beginner and Matt and Dan who are both beginners as well and showing them the proper technique and form for these movements and I told them if you put 100% into the gym, you will see results because I started where they were and yeah, I started from the bottom and I slowly worked my way up learning about nutrition, which supplements worked or not. There's so many supplements that are bogus by the way and learning uh, the rep ranges like 8 to 12 is hypertrophy, 1 to 6 is uh, in the strength range and just playing around with different kinds of programs such as the powerlifting which I found great results in and did very well in and of course the mass training such as this program. Uh, Matt, Dan and I were also discussing like the, ba the basic beginner, uh, beginner conversation. I've heard this a million times like which supplements are the best, which brands are the best and I told them, I just basically told them that you have to start with from a base so get your, get your knowledge down. Take creatine that's proven uh, you can have a uh, protein supplement like a whey supplement to hit your protein better and I told them you have to go above your maintenance calories to grow so I hooked them up with my fitness pal and I showed them where to start with that so if they are diligent with hitting their protein and their calories for the day uh, they will see results if they put in work in the gym as well. So quick recap if you're a beginner. Uh, take creatine, uh, it'll help your power output. Uh, supplement with whey protein if you have a hard time hitting your protein through whole foods. I prefer whole foods. Um, and find your maintenance calories and go above your maintenance calories if you're trying to bulk. 
I recommend 200 to 400 above your maintenance. And also get a good multivitamin and fish oil. And as you know, we finish off every uh, chest day with the crossovers and the dips, the superset. And right here you see me, uh, don't worry about my form, I know it was bad form, I was using a lot of momentum. Uh, I was using 50 right here, so the last three sets I moved it down to 40 to control the stretch and the contraction at the bottom. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did like the video, uh, make sure to thumbs it up. It really helps me out. I'll see you guys in the next video, probably episode 12 of Hercules, the back day. I'll be showing these guys some more tips there, so I'll see you guys later.